Taiwan continues to slam Japan over its nationalization of disputed islands in the East China Sea, with the Coast Guard slated to take reporters to the Yutai Islands tomorrow. But at home, a former president criticized the Ma administration's efforts, urging it to instead focus on problems in Taiwan. After receiving notification from the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, Taiwan's top envoy to Japan, Shun Tsutsun, immediately returned to Taiwan. He said he already delivered a message to the Japanese government. Yesterday in Tokyo, I delivered a strong protest to the Japanese Interchange Association President, Tadashi Imae. While the Ma administration has made its stern opposition to Japan's purchase of the islands clear, many wondered how former President Lee dong would respond. He has previously said the Diaoyutai Islands are Japan's. That's their issue. It involves the Japanese government and a Japanese citizen's property rights. It has nothing to do with us. The Diaoyutai Islands dispute between Taiwan and Japan is only a fishing issue. It isn't a question of sovereignty. Lee served as president for 12 years. He said he had little recollection of the historical documents the Ma administration refers to when making Taiwan's sovereignty claim. These documents apparently are land registration deeds from 1971, showing the Diaoyutai Islands as part of Ilan County. In 1971, he could just say something and that was enough. When did you win the Diaoyutai Islands from Japan in a war? Or how else did you earn the right to claim these islands? You're just talking nonsense. Taiwan's economic problems are so bad, and all these internal problems are still unresolved. You beat the Diaoyutai Islands drum, but you may be fooling yourself into thinking the average citizen cares. Lee made his comments while visiting Nanto. He was looking at reconstruction progress ahead of the 13th anniversary of the September 21st earthquake. 